I was 10 years old when I hopped on a freight train out of Tucson, Arizona. That day I had come home from school to find Dad home early. He was in the kitchen cooking dinner. I kept asking for something to eat. And he said, no, Elizabeth, wait until dinner. Eventually he told me to go to my room and I told him I wish I had never been adopted. He slapped me so hard in my face that tears came to my eyes. Up to that day, my daddy had never put his hands on me. And he had always tried to protect me from my abusive mother. When he slapped me, I ran to my room and closed the door. I opened the window like it was a portal. I popped the screen out, climbed over, and ran away. I walked until I came across the desert. I saw a moving train rolling in the distance. I ran and ran and ran until I caught up to it. There was an open boxcar. I ran along the side and hoisted myself up into the boxcar. Once inside, I felt a sense of relief. Where could this train take me at 10? As I sat near the open door of the train, I looked out at the desert's shifting beige shapes. It could take me to California on the other side of the desert. It could take me to its golden fields. The box car was dark and junky, but maybe it was bright and beautiful. Maybe it contained crystals and jewels. And if I went far enough, they'd be mine. Maybe the train would never stop and it would keep going until I was surrounded by big water. Or maybe this train would take me into the sky. <laughs>